Welcome back to Sherlock Holmes Chapter 1. It looks like there's some chemical analysis to be done. So let's take care of that. Oh, this feels easy. Oh, not quite. Do that one, and then... We have to go ahead and do a, a positive 2 to do the math correctly, and then it's, uh... Hold an X to link. Do that. And then we can go ahead and combine these. And do that! Success! I mean, I've extracted pheromones from the liquid. Why we can't do this in the normal, fun, puzzly methods? Nini seemed to know us sewing inside out. Oh, I bet she missed us. I hope Miss Nini won't misunderstand me. <laughs> we'll see. Well, let's talk. Uh, well, we have... And, uh, which part of the elephant is in here? It's quite pungent. Oh, that. It's elephant sweat. Father believed that it might replace traditional amber grease. Well, that's true entrepreneur spirit. Oh, there's a lot to talk about. Have you seen what your father sent to Paul? This is despicable. My father was never a gentleman, but this crosses the line. I knew that father wasn't fond of Paul, but this... This is just awful. If only he could have seen how good Paul is to me. Speaking of Polly... <laughs> I'm afraid I can't add anything oh, to Are you aware that Paul smuggles drugs for a dangerous gang? Mr. Holmes, I've already told you. I call him a pirate in play. He's not an actual pirate. He's a champion and a brave gentleman, not a thug. Let us agree to disagree on that. But don't be surprised if one of his clients knocks on your door. Alright, you're done. And now I have to wonder, do we just finish this case or, uh, not? Gosh. What a mansion. Probably wants to want to just uh keep the case and then do side casing. Hmm. Something new in the mine palace. Uh, where is the thing hunting a Goliath? Especially he which blah. Mrs. Ninny at the intersection of Knights and Trinity and Scaladio. Okay. I still need to know what this mysterious thing is about. I've been meaning to try and figure that out for the longest time. But alas. Was Miss Ninny the, uh, lady we disguised ourselves for so she could figure it out? Yep, because that's totally where we're headed. Okay. Let's do this. Nay. Down this pathway. Past the child. Man, you remember what it's like to be a child, Cherry? Is it you? Good day, madam. I've come to you with a special requirement. The tailors on the street can't help me, I'm afraid. Could you make a... Doll for me. Oh, Senior Holmes, you taught the police how to do their job, and they found the thief. Of course, I will help you. But what sort of doll? A child's doll, such as my great niece might play with? Um, a little larger than your typical doll. Signore, I don't understand. Boy, girl, animal, and what color? Animal. Um, a passionate, perhaps amorous animal. Ah, oh, signore, you talk in riddles. I am an old lady who's seen it all. Tell me what you need. I need a life-size elephant. I think Mrs. Nini outdid herself with this one. Is that a tail? That's a trunk, John, but I must agree with you that it's a masterpiece. Well, let's not waste any time. Cool. Yeah, do we have that? <laughs> And also, I'm rather impressed at how quickly she managed to do that. Where do you want me to go for this? Okay. I should, uh, use the coal shed in Gildan's yard to inflate the- in- yeah, inflate the lure. Where is the coal shed? Is it this place all the way up here? Hmm. Nope. I'm confused. Oh, up, uh, idiot. 
Gildan's the man that's dead, which means back here. Yeah, I guess we should finish this case before I forget everything relevant about it. What's it that weird, like, red? It's the sun trying to set and doing a poor job, I think, kid. Alright. Here we are. The game is on. So, what's the plan? I hope it all doesn't go horribly wrong. We know that the elephant is seeking a female. We can arrange that. A doll with the appropriate scent might do miracles. So you're... a marriage broker? Well, I suppose that makes me a groomsman. Oh, she is a bit breezy, I must say. Well, Goliath is eager for a single female elephant in his area. It should be just enough for his taste. You'll need to trust me. Are we ready? I can't stand the tension. We're ready. Let's call the elephant. All right, let's go ahead and, of course, it's not going to be easy. So let's try this one. Thank you for the translation, game. How could anyone resist? All right, let's try. I knew a lady once who said just that. How about... Too bad I'm not an elephant. <laughs> I don't even know what this one means. Take your time, Sherry. And how about... That deserves a slap, and then a kiss. And here's our lovesick friend. What is the meaning of this? Why are you bringing it here? I won't allow you to leave it. I assure you that it is only a temporary measure. It won't be long until the elephant is gone, I promise you. They just need a place to keep it, you know, right? I reckon this is better than anywhere else. Dang balloon. Well, time to investigate and see what's up. We have a dart here. Hey. Thank you. There's something in the needle. But what? A feathered fletching. This might be promising. Chemical analysis, I assume, for that. Key evidence has been found, but let's continue investigating. It itself while running through the forest. Okay. Uh, a little scary actually being this close to an elephant, not gonna lie. Even though I'm not playing, not like in left the game. Tusk is larger and more worn. You're a left tusked elephant. Interesting. There's John. There should be one more thing. Peaceful and compliant. Almost a gentleman. Alright. Everything's found. Now we can talk to you. Want to talk about the elephant in the yard? Yeah, I don't blame you. Let's leave and never come back. The game has not actually said that it's oh that's right, chemical analysis. I say, hasn't said that, you know, his mind palace stuff to do. Oh boy. You're gonna make me think, game? Make me think. Ugh. Drat. I didn't want to think. I'll play. Actually, this might be easier than I think. Oh wait, that's right! Addition- okay, let me reset this real quickly. Yes. I forgot that they have introduced the change signs... ...icon, which means this is actually really easy. Let's just flip that to negative four. Add a positive three. Combine them. If it'll let me, thank you. You get... ...the answer! Excellent. 
There are traces of striking blah blah inside this amount could kill a human, but it's not enough to topple such a large animal. Instead, they just made him aggressive. And now, the elephant may have been provoked, King. And Arthur and Paul may have shot it. Leading to interesting choices of deduction. Go with that one. We reached the true answer to the case, which is Goliath killed Theodore. But there are other conclusions you can make to the game, I believe. So if we back out and change a few things to say this, we get Paul killed Theodore. But that's the wrong answer. I think it's the wrong answer, at least. I mean, I have no problems throwing, um, Paul in the clink. <laughs> okay. Okay. The correct answer is... It was just Goliath. So we'll go ahead and switch this around. There we go. We don't, neither of these really make a difference. The fit of rage, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can execute or save. Um. You get an achievement for saying save, so I guess we'll go ahead and do that since they kind of, I guess, guide you with the achievements to figure out what the correct answer is. So let's go ahead and save him. It's a pacifist answer after all. Okay. Why can't I go to the mine palace still? Okay. I would love to know how we're supposed to, uh, proceed if. Although the game actually seems like if it's doing it that way, it's uncertain. About, uh... Or uncertain as in it's telling me that's wrong? And we'll find out when we talk. You were right about Goliath. Everyone confirmed your opinion. They all agree that the beast is vicious. The animal wielded two tons of rage and Mr. Gildan regrettably didn't stand a chance. The mating season only served to amplify its temper. Oh, spare me. That's a little too much detail, thank you. What is the point of this conclusion? How do you plan to use your findings? Well... I don't know. I, I don't like... Doing the killing option, so as much as you're gonna hate this... Miss Gildan, I know, I know how much you dislike the elephant. Rather more than dislike. I wish I could have done more to that wretch than just speak of it. But it's innocent. Goliath did not intend to kill your father. It was provoked, scared, scared, and in mating season. Your father took Goliath's normal state for granted, and in doing so made a mistake that caused the elephant to be aggressive. Stop it! I already know the answer. I don't need your moral perspective on this situation. I don't know why you wasted your time. I actually did more than you. Which involved what, Miss Gildan? A man with a big wallet made an offer to take the elephant away. I accepted it. I was so naive thinking that it was me who was so helpless. But you are useless too. I am glad that the elephant is no longer of your concern, but I need to make sure. I don't care and I don't want to listen. Thought you wouldn't turn up. Why is that? I suppose it's the English way to leave without saying goodbye, but I never planned to abandon you. Because you brought the filthy beast here. Because you did nothing to ensure its proper punishment. I had to do everything, not you. I was piecing together your father's murder. There was nothing to piece together. I told you, it was Goliath. I never asked you to, never asked you to talk with anyone. I asked you to find the stupid animal. Even if my efforts are invisible, that does not mean that I did nothing. I don't have the strength to argue. These are my father's belongings. They're about your mother. Take them all and leave me be. I won't waste your time any longer, Miss Gildan. Thank you for your help. All right. We'll go ahead and take this. Which is... A note. 
reading, 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 reading. And this. A VH for? My mother always wore this around her neck until one day it disappeared. I was wondering where it went. She said it was a birthday present from a good friend. I just had another glimpse of a memory, John. It's fuzzy, but I'm sure it happens somewhere in the manor. Finally moving forward. Shall we go? Better question, where are you? Um, uh, hiding. I guess we'll never know. Okay. And the gate has been fixed, so you can never go back in there. It's fine by me, I don't want to go back in there. Um, there's more stuff in Mind Palace land. Going back to this. Which I don't actually want to deal with. Uh, we are going to continue the side cases. Uh, starting with... I guess we'll go with... Well, let's finish the police cases. Uh, let's go back to... And I want to... I want to about that so bad. Uh, to the Cordona Police Station to investigate this man's office. Yay! Investigating. Okay. So his office, I think, is on this side. Uh, how wrong I was. Not in either of those directions. Okay. What are you up to? I can almost picture you as an inspector, Sherlock. You'd lie on his sofa all day and still solve more cases than the rest of the police. Heh. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we have a safe. Oh, safe is worthless. Police board. No? Ah, here we go. I saw something. When the studio's horn, you know, well, that cannot allow. You're an indispensable asset to this apartment, plus, Placido. <laughs> uh, sorry, but your time is not the question. We need more than ever. The city needs you to think about it. All right. Let's see. You got an empty revolver spot. This must have been an award for long and faithful service. Interesting. A box of snuff. Strong stuff. We also have this. No, that's worthless. Hive gang police raid. Is the hive master dead? Let's go and raid the operation. Yeah, serious problem. Number of gang in war. Russell, fire, mesh officer in the game and gunfight. Okay. Got it. That's that, Cordona Chronicle. No need to go. Why look at. Why do archives research when all the information is just here in the office, right? The files are gone, that's odd. What else? Ah, I guess on this. Hive Master. Crime Lords just love catchy monikers. Sure. Okay. And then over here. Oh, we have that, but first I want to make sure there's nothing. There's nothing more, so. Go ahead and pin that. Oh, lots of information, actually. What's behind here? Yeah, a can. An uh, ear. Now, now that is odd, to say the least. Very, I agree. Clutch of local nationwide newspapers all mention the Hive and Hive Master are organized chrono chronologically. This is, I guess this is your Hive villainy group, whatever, something, Teen Titans. Hive 5, that's what I'm thinking about. Let's take the ear, Sherry. It'll bring us luck. You'll see. Good lord, you can't be serious. Fine. Nice. Always play it by ear, pal. By listening to what you want us to do. Okay. 
Uh, the last page reads, the city hall records said miners N-87. See, right? I'm going all along. Wait, we have to go to city hall to look this up? No, I'll go to city hall to look this up. I have to leave the police station first, though, because fast travel broken in building. Why they made that mechanic that way, I don't know. Okay. To, not that one. To city hall. Oh, and I have to remember to pick up that, too. City Hall's right here. Yeah, City Hall, or I'm wasting my time by coming here because it's actually in the archives at the, uh, police station. Although, if it was in the archives at the police station, the guy would have found it, I think. So, going to City Hall makes no sense. Okay. A question of Hive Oracle. I don't care. Which is the one I want? This one. The Hive Master. Mm -hmm. Okay. Same year, same district as the gunfight. Which would have been when? Buzz off. Hi, Master Mystery. Oh, I know. No response. Okay. Same year, same districts as a gunfight. Okay, well, let's go with... 1800s. Uh... Miners and... I don't actually know. Oh, sweet! First try! Business entity registered in 1877. Documents filed for closure in January 1880. Warehouse in Miner's End sold in February. The Distillery Miner's It's all Miner's End. And then an actual location. Early for sale. Clay Street by Stevenson's Bridge to Silverton. Okay. So Miner's End. Stevenson's Bridge. So, oh wow, that's actually a really convenient fast travel point. First, let's actually get outside so I can go there. Have you found anything helpful? Yep, and we're leaving. Okay. All the way over to... Not that one. Here. That's close enough, and it, that guy broke. Alright. And then I'll actually read this. On Clay Street. Which is across the bridge. Alright, perfect. Let's go ahead and go across. Don't fall off. That's oh wow, that was a bigger hole than I thought it was. Okay, and then well, the warehouse will be over probably this. It's that. Going out on Hive Master's orders. Cornelius said he knows what he looks like, but he's full of it. Who saw the Hive Master? I'm just gonna keep doing this thing. Why is the Ghost of Cordona on here? Thank you. Remember the rank and file of the hive don't know what their boss looks like. Apparently they've never seen the hive master in person. Well Yeah, we found the Queen's warehouse. There are some chaps inside and they're armed. Be careful, Sherry. Well, you know what that means. It's time for another fight. Let's uh fight then. And then we'll be done actually. Because it'll take like what, five minutes to fight, and that's all the time we have left? This is hive territory. Shoot him, boys. Never! Why anyway, am I yelling never at him? I'm glad that worked. I was a little uncertain if it would. As seems to be if every time I use these environmental gizmos and gadgets to fight. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Yeah, let's get to a place where it's easier to concentrate. Go ahead and reload. Take that, and the brute now. there we go. Perfect time to heal. And by heal, I mean beat this guy up, and then we get our health Too back. Simple. The snuff's ready. The snuff's ready. Eat lead. Never. I didn't hit him. I hit him in the wrong spot. Dang it. I don't want to kill people, guys, and you can't redo story fights. So, yeah, don't mess up. He's all yours now. Go all for right. it. Oh, sweet. 
perfect time for you to reload. There we go. Oh. Oh. Give him the pepper snuff. Look him here. There we go. Game. Thank you. For nothing. How many that worked? Wasn't sure if it would. That didn't work, boo. That should do it. I really would like to, uh, you know, not die. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> That's a fun sound. Why can't I get that guy switching? Hmm, I don't even know. He's just gonna... This game has had problems since it's come out, I take it. There's been a lot of, uh... Battle glitches I didn't recall. From my first time around. There's still armor on this guy, isn't there? No? Oh, never mind. Everyone come close, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's not gonna work. You know what? Screw it. Do it this way. I was trying to use the environment, but I could just throw pocket sand at ya. Don't cry, you'll live. There we go. Too simple. Oh, Even that's about to blow. Snuff. Yeah, it's not gonna be as much use to me though. Unless Well if it would hurt and blow up, Get maybe it'll be useful. You may be invincible, but your your friends aren't! I still got two of these guys. Don't the hard cry, thing will be... Snuff's ready. Yeah, I was gonna say, getting this guy I'm coming for without you. hitting the other guy. I couldn't miss the party. Give him the pepper snuff. Stop crouching. Thank you. There we go. Oof. Owie. Oof. Owie. Okay. Well, you're down. Ooh, that didn't work. Should have worked. Fine. That. There we go. Don't that it? Moving. Sweet. Lost. Everyone's lost. That guy's still twitching. Cool. Well, now we should. Yeah, we're gonna investigate because it'll throw me off if I try and leave. And the game is having a heart attack because of the way Bandy Cam likes to record. A glitch I've been trying for. Seems like years now to figure out why it's doing that, and I can't, so shucks. Okay. Game, stop it. I know you want me to stop, and I will as soon as we finish this investigation. We'll go a little over just for the sake of finishing the investigation. Okay. Where, which one of these doors is actually the door I can take? Okay, this one. There we go. Here we are, and you're always here first. Smells of burnt paper. Just another day in a smuggler's office. Okay. Hmm. Everything knits together. <laughs> we have this. Can't spare any boys, Cal. Too busy wrapping up. Same as you. The boss has gone soft. Shutting down when we have the island in our pockets. Makes no sense to me. There's always a reason you just gotta understand. Score up a cards? No, it's money. Uh, it's this. Burn the documents, prepare the goods, I will deal with the apiary. Apiary, whatever that says. Yeah, that's key evidence, but that's probably not all the evidence in here. Didn't think so. You can look in here. Someone's been burning papers, I see. Okay. And then there is going to be... This. This is the burnt paper. Cool. Everything? Or is there more? Ooh, there's more. What more evidence could there be? Hmm. Well, let's see. The secret door? No. Is it in here? It is. It's this box. What a convenient way to pull the wool over the eyes of the customs house. Heh. <laughs> That's funny. There we go, that's the jingle I was waiting for. And that's where we're gonna stop, so next time. 
on Sherlock Holmes chapter one. We'll go ahead and continue our investigation into the police investigator. See you guys then.